Hey everybody, welcome back to Guns and Gadgets, your source for Second Amendment news. Got something cool to show you. I've been uh, testing this product for a couple of months, to be honest with you. And uh, it took me a while to convince myself that I needed it. But once I knew that I needed it, I will never stop wearing it now, if you know what I mean. Uh, this is an ankle medical kit by Lynx Defense. Okay, I will have a link in the description. Uh, they sent this to me. Um, right after SHOT Show in January, I probably got it in February, and for a while, you know, I, I would wear it and be like, eh, I don't know if this is something I would employ, honestly. But then I saw some, uh, some officer-involved shooting in, in Las Vegas, and the police officer, one of the police officers on the scene had a similar product, and he took his tourniquet out of it and applied it to uh, a victim that was on scene that they shot and they saved the man's life. Um, it was that moment that I realized not only is this something that people uh, need and they don't know it, something that is easily concealable, comfortable to wear, but it's a lifesaver. And that video alone made me realize that it, at least in my line of work, it's something I should be carrying. And no matter what I do, whether I'm riding my motorcycle, uh, whether I'm out at the range, out with the kids, the wife, or even at work, I have some gunshot wound care here. I have a tr small trauma kit, uh, and I'll show this to you and, and uh, give you a link in the description. But uh, thank you to Link's Defense for saying this. I know it's been a while for this uh, for this review, but I have worn this in areas where I, you know, I was getting ready to do the review and say, oh, you know what, I have this class coming up. Let me see how it feels during that class. Or I have this training coming up. Let me see if if it won't work or won't be uh, comfortable or won't be uh, utilized during that class. And to be honest with you, I was trying to convince myself that this wouldn't be comfortable. It is. Uh, I have tried and it has it has won. It has beat me. I, now I tried to clean it up. So if it's a little dirty, I apologize. It's been, you know, sweat and dirt and mud and rain. Um, but I'll show you what I keep in it. Uh, I have just a, a cat tourniquet here. Um, I have some some combat gauze, quick watt there, and uh, just dropped it. And I have some more gauze here. Now I took a couple things out um, just to bring it upstairs um, for the review, but I'll show it to you. It's it's it is 18 and a half inches long, five and a half inches wide. It's not big. Once you get it on, you wear it above your sneaker, above your boot. You just wrap it around your leg. Velcro it on, it's good to go. You can use this for whatever you want. You don't even have to use this for medical gear. You want to use, use this, you go on a vacation, you want to throw your wallet or money or your cards, uh, your ID, stuff that's important. You want to keep it so that it's not in your pockets. Being a target, this is an awesome thing for that. There are six pockets, really, in this thing, and I'll show them to you here. Uh, you have two uh, long, well, vertical ones here that uh, easily take tourniquets and make them very comfortable to wear. Now, I will tell you that you saw that I was wearing a cat tourniquet. A soft tee fits in there perfect and is much more comfortable to wear than, than the uh, the cat, honestly, because it doesn't extend above and you don't have to worry about it catching on your sock or whatever. I use cats, uh, so that's what I, what I just ran. But if you fold it the correct way, it doesn't cause an issue at all. So you, can, you could put two if you wanted there, but you can put anything you want in here, a cutting tool, pens, um, anything you can think of that will fit in there and it's it's elasticized okay so you got a little stretch there and it has a catch on the bottom so you don't have to worry about stuff falling out so there's two of those and then there's two here that have uh, velcro pocket covers or straps um, and those are two by three uh, the strap it is and it goes down um, no, you know, the whole, just about the whole five and a half inches. It's about five inch deep uh, and it stretches as well, okay, because it's a compression pocket. You can fit, I mean, you can fit a lot in there. I mean, I got half of a fist in there. So <laughs> you get a lot of room with this. Now, this other one is identical and then there's spots behind them. Um, it does not have a stop on the bottom, but it, once you have this wrapped around your leg, uh, it's if you wedge something in there, like a wallet, it's not going to fall out. Uh, but you could even put that in one of these uh, pouches so it locks in. Uh, very comfortable to wear. Uh, like I said, you want to throw in some chest seals. You want to throw in uh, something to cut seat belts. Uh, and then you have a, an entire trauma kit here on your ankle, readily accessible. On the inside, there is a, uh, a rubberized textured gripping strip. So it will lock on 
to your sock or to your laced boot or whatever and not just keep riding up and down. Uh, it's it's extremely comfortable, it really is. It's very well made. These are handmade, by the way. Uh, it's a great little product. Now it's made of 500D uh, Cordura, so it's gonna last. It's very abrasion resistant. And every single product they use, whether it's the patch, the thread, the Cordura, the uh, elastic, uh, the Velcro, every little bit of it is sourced from a US company. Uh, so it's American made. Um, that alone, get it. I'll have a link in the description. They're $34.99, uh, which is chump change if you are looking in the market for uh, trauma kits and stuff like that and stuff. And it's just something that really, I didn't know I needed it until I needed it. Uh, I have used this on my job. It has been great. So thank you to Link's Defense for sending this. I appreciate your patience and getting this out, but I wanted to, um, I wanted to make sure it stood up to everything I thought it wouldn't, and it has. It has performed perfectly. That is why I'm telling you here on my channel that this is something I would recommend you get. All right. Uh, think about it. If you're at the range and you're in the middle of nowhere, or it's minutes to even get to a road, and a lot of ranges we go to are in the back of woods somewhere, uh, it's good to have supplies on hand You know when you need it instead of hoping that the guys and gals come in with the lights and siren get there to help uh, stop a bleed before it's too late. So small investment. It doesn't come with medical gear. If you're interested in knowing that question right away, no, you'd still have to put in your own, but that also helps if you're not looking to use it for a medical kit, you wanna use it for vacation, for money, credit cards, wallets, uh, you know, thumb drives, whatever. Uh, this is a great, great option. So check them out. Link uh, is in the description. It's linksdefense.com. If you get one, I know you will be happy um, and you'll wear it every day like I do. Now today I'm wearing shorts and it's 96 degrees out and I'll be on the motorcycle, so I think people might look at it, but it's still going to be with me. This is Jared from Guns and Gadgets. If you haven't already, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. This is where you're going to get great reviews on Second Amendment related products and also Second Amendment news, whether it's good, bad, ugly, or indifferent, just as fast as it comes out right here on Guns and Gadgets. Until we see each other again, be safe, stay vigilant, carry a weapon, always have a trauma kit on you. Take care, everybody.